Hello friend, welcome to my channel, I'm Alice and um, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Today I thought I'd finally do the um, July setup video. It's not really the One Book July because I do still use my um, passport size for my um, spending tracker stuff like that and I don't really want to um, move that insert into here because feel like yeah, it, it would be kind of, I don't know, I'm lazy and it works in the password size so I don't want to move this around but this one do, um, does stay home right now and I'm just taking this one out of me. So this one is the one that gets the most use right now. So let's get into it. Um, you can see I use my Panem, my, my blue edition one and I do have the um, the brass tag and it's changed color actually I was really amazed by it because I didn't even realize but it's it has gotten a darker color very beautiful and um, I do always keep my twisty fountain pen with me because it writes very fine and currently it is inked with Lidete I'm not sure I can't pronounce it but it's the brown J urban ink yeah and um, I don't have the Midori clip on pen loop because I heard that it moves and stuff and it's not very secure so I didn't want that. What I did was that I just bought one of the Leuchtturm um, pen loops and instead of sticking it at the back I just turned it upside down so now the, the um, what's it called? The mark, the marking is upside down, but I put it in the front because I don't like it if my pen is hooked on here and if I just set my notebook down and if it clacks against the table. So I thought, oh well, I could just put it in the front and this way it won't make a lot of noise. But I mean, if I open it, of course it will lie down, but usually if I open it, I'm writing anyway, so yeah. Then at the front, um, oh yeah, I also have one of these sticker um, sticker pockets that from the Midori. Usually I keep receipts in here and I also have one at the back, but I took them out just for privacy reasons. And um, the first insert is the Faroof zipper insert and I did make an unboxing video of that. If you want to check it out, I will link it down below. Um, I guess most of you know this pocket, um, no, this insert, and um, actually this flap folds over like this. Okay, sorry, I had to move my cards out. Usually this flap folds over like this, and here you have your three card slots, and um, the thing is, I mean, usually if you keep it close and then you have the elastic wrapped around, it's safe enough. But um, since the only cards I have with me are my ID cards, my credit card and um, health insurance card. And those are really important, I don't want them to fall out. So I just flip the, um, this flap over so it protects the card and then I use a clip. Oops, a clip to clip it down like this and I can still get to my money easily um, but it keeps the money secure enough so the money is like this and if I want to get a card it this will usually flap open if I clip it down so I will keep my debit card and my credit card here and here up are some cards that you don't use that often so it works very well and um, I've used this now for I think about a week and it has stayed up beautifully. The, the color is so nice and the um, material, it's just some kind of fabric but it feels so so beautiful. It looks so nice with the Travis notebook and it adds little to no bulk. I mean of course you have the zipper insert and the zipper insert, um, no the zipper is um, out of made out of metal. So of course it's gonna bulk a little bit here but other than that the insert is actually really thin, so that's what I really appreciate about it because I don't like it if it's too bulky. So let's move on. That's the first insert and it's just wrapped around right at the back. I think I was out of frame, sorry if I am. 
Um, so let's move on. The second insert, or well, the actually the first notebook that I have is just a monthly overview. And um, it's a free insert, meaning that you can date it yourself and use it whenever you need to. So I will use the Olic clip to clip it open so it's easier to find. Then it has the elastic and it is connected with one of the Midori rubber bands. Um, the second elastic. Uh, last I'm sorry. <laughs> the second notebook um, is actually a folder that I made myself and also that this was also a video that I made and um, I will link this below as well but I mean I could just show you right now. It's actually my Hobonichi Techo, the evac that I slipped in into this um, folder that I made and this way it's kind of like a cover, a book cover which protects the the um, Hobonichi and this way I can keep it in my in my Midori without damaging the book maybe because I still feel like the paper is really thin and I don't know maybe I'm just a little bit scared and currently I just use it to um, it, it's my journal currently it's my main journal and that's been it's been a lot of fun actually I write every day and it's beautifully and I do have the um, the pencil board to keep it nice and flat and I, and then I still have this clear PVC plastic sheet that I keep so that it doesn't bleed and when I draw so that my hands don't wrinkle the paper doesn't wrinkle the paper yep that's it and then at the back I currently only have some washi samples so I don't have I don't hold anything in my pockets right now because I don't have I don't use a lot of ephemera or stickers or anything in this um I don't want it to be too bulky and I'm not sure currently it's been just a lot of fun to draw in it and um, use watercolor and improve my sketches so yep that's it and um, lastly the zipper side from the for roof pouch whoops and um, it just holds some coins and cash and stuff like that well I don't have a lot of coins right now and basically that's it um well at the back again the pocket sticker and as you can see it's I think it has a night a, a night <laughs> a nice a nice um width like it's not too bulky but it just has this for me it's just the right amount of inserts because it has this nice grip feeling to it and um but it's still not too bulky although i do like it when they get quite bulky but then it's too heavy and my shoulders hurt so yeah i bring this with me everywhere and i do need to change my tabs because this one says this week although it's monthly insert and this one is currently yeah mm. I guess that's it. Um, you know, it's very simple. I just need the monthly for my um, appointments. That's the word I was looking for. Appointments. <laughs> I need this for my appointments, and the Hoonichi is just for my um, regular journaling, diary kind of thing. So this one goes with me everywhere, and mainly, actually, that's it. I don't have a lot to tell you about it but I still hope you enjoyed it I will probably still be doing um, a setup video for my traveling um, I'm still trying to figure out what to bring so I mean I, I do want to bring my passport size and for sure the regular size but I don't know how to set them up or what inserts to bring so yeah We'll see about that. Yes, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you the next time when I'm doing my letter care video. Thanks for watching. Bye.